welcome back gamers to the official zap hosting youtube channel my name is ellie and in today's tutorial i will show you how to upload your own palward save game to your zap palward server so let's get started firstly press the windows key and the r buttons at the same time on your keyboard and the new window will open here you will need to paste in the following command that you will find in the video description after pasting it in click on ok a file explorer window will now open after that navigate to the first folder here you will find all your palward save game folders sadly the folder names are randomized so if you want to find the correct save game to upload to the server you will have to find the correct folder by following the next steps launch palward on your pc in the game click on start game and join the world you wish to get the save game for once you join click on escape button and press return to title after doing so go back to file explorer here you will be able to find your save game by looking at the date modify tab as it will show up as the most recent modified folder after finding your save game go to your zap interface and navigate to the ftp browser tab which can be found right here on the left here you will find your ftp credentials launch your preferred ftp client and log in using the provided credentials after logging in, open the first folder, then Palward, Pal, Saved, Save Games, and lastly Zero. Here you will need to upload your save game, so simply click and drag your folder right here into the box. After successfully uploading the folder, right click on it, click on Rename, and then copy the name of the folder. After that, simply navigate back and then open the config folder, then Linux server. Here, find the file named GameUserSettings.ini, right click on it and then click on Edit. Now find and change the dedicated server server name parameter, delete everything after the equal sign and paste in your uploaded save game name that you copied earlier. After that, save the file and close the window. If you get a pop-up, simply press on yes. Now go back to your zap interface, start your server and the server should now load with your own save game. If you have any questions, you can contact our support by creating a ticket on our website or live chat and we will be more than happy to help you out. Now have a lovely rest of the week and enjoy playing on your zap server.